I just had this thought of what if I invited death to be a part of my experience, a part of my day? Death's just the word I'm using for a feeling of something wanting to be experienced that I might be resisting some form of discomfort, um, something maybe wanting to release or integrate or just be felt, which often for me is a process of some sort of grieving, crying sort of um, expression. Hmm. And I feel like there's these moments where I feel it, I feel it waiting for me. And the auto response is often to not go there, to resist, um, to maybe distract. What can I do instead, <laughs> instead of feel that? And um, that might look like pulling out my phone. Uh, it might look like eating something. Even something simple like grabbing grabbing my water or just like, it's kind of like this, what can I do to distract from that feeling in this moment? <clears throat> and when I'm aware of that happening, I'll often just stop and close my eyes and just kind of... But what felt different in this moment, the thought I just had was, <clears throat> what if I like consciously welcome it as as a part of my my day maybe as a part of my morning maybe in the evening maybe both whenever uh not waiting not necessarily waiting for it but just saying hey if that's you know wanting to be a part of my experience today um i'm available for that i'm uh i would like to be the space for that experience to unfold um in a potentially less resistant way. Because um, it, it feels like an inevitability for me that there's just kind of birth, death, birth, death, like creation, destruction, expansion, contraction, that that's, um, that's what this is. So, so I feel like why not welcome it and embrace it and somehow, um, Invite myself to move with those cycles. Rather than feeling like, oh, that half of the game I don't like and I'm going to find something else to do. Because it's all one thing. It's the sense that like, you know, like maybe we could think of it as an infinity kind of thing. or Um... <laughs> It just doesn't feel to me like I can have one without the other. Um, that hasn't been my experience. Open to the possibility that it could just be, you know, just continuous birth or joy or freedom or what. <laughs> I mean, sure. Uh, it doesn't seem to be what this experience is. It doesn't seem to be when I look at nature, when I observe. Um, yeah, it seems more dynamic than that. <sighs> so yeah, I think I'm going to do that. I'm like, hmm, do I want to do that on camera or just... I feel like I did that yesterday on camera. I made a video where I just sat in silence and allowed the process to unfold. For some reason, I was guided to film it and share it. So... Yeah, I don't feel like it's necessary to engage in that. This was more sharing of the thoughts around it. Um, yeah. Just like it's all beautiful, it's all welcome. Here, death, whatever we want to call it, discomfort, resistance, you're welcome here. Thanks for visiting. I'm going to throw you a party by being the space for you to be whatever you want or need to be in this moment and a gratitude 
because I know it's all part of this beautiful game that I get to experience, and you're a valuable contributor.